Hi, I'm Ken Kaplan from Kaplan Cycles and I'm going to give you a complete demo of this awesome Triumph 750. Let me fire it up for you. Bike was start first kick for you pretty much every time. It's an awesome bike. Motor's real tight and rebuilt. We're indoors here, I don't want to smoke ourselves out, but uh, um, bike runs awesome. It's a very high performance motor. Uh, the long history of this bike, I'll start at the beginning. The guy I bought it from, bought it in, in uh, 1965. He's owned it since it was, I guess uh, he was the second owner, but it was maybe a year old when he bought it. And uh, he had owned it for 40 years. Um, and his wife, who when I bought it from him said that uh, she was with him when he bought it and uh, with him when he sold it. And he did all he did all the customization on it. It was originally a TR6, I believe, is a model that, that originally was. Uh, where's the title to it? Where's it paid for? Um, is that it right there? Oh, there it's over here. I got the title to it right here. And uh, uh, let's see here. It's titled as a TR6, yes, 1965 TR6. So that was correct, it is a TR6. And he bought it 40 years ago, and uh, it was stock when he bought it, and he started out modifying it by putting the hardtail rear end on it, then he had the front end raked, and he put the Springer front end on it. Um, starting at the front, it's got the nice spoke wheel, uh, Springer front end, with the um, cover on this side right here, it has the copper, Copper fitting, he said it's been like this since it was brand new. It's got a really cool custom paint job that covers the whole bike, including the frame. This is period correct stuff. Um, it's got these really cool uh, chopper style bars. Everything's chrome up on the top here. The whole front end's chrome on it. Uh, the engine's polished aluminum. Uh, Hardtail rear rim with a 16 inch chrome rear, uh, rear rim. Uh, last year, before we bought the bike, from him, he did a bunch of upgrades on it. If you look, it's got a brand new, there's less than 50 miles on the exhaust, brand new custom exhaust, fishtail exhaust, and he put the Makuni uh, carburetors on here. High performance, modern Makuni carbs, so the thing runs really strong. Um, one of the coolest features on this bike was originally a 650, he put a rut 650 big bore, check these cylinders out. It's a set, it's a 650 originally, and it's now a 750 cc top end. Uh, when he changed the top end from the TR6 single carb, he went with the dual carb Bonville top end. So this is a 750 Bonville top end. So the entire top end of this, the block is a 65, but the top end is a, is a 750 big bore. So this is a bike you could put into it. You could take this engine and put this into a, um, a performance Triumph chassis, and this thing would just, you know, be an awesome dirt tracker or ice racer. It's a very high performance motor, and kind of, uh, if you want to keep it in, in the chopper frame and, uh, I have a lot of fun with it. You'll surprise some people with this thing because it rips. Um, it has a brand new drag specialty seat. So the seat, the exhaust, the carburetors, and the tires. I put a couple grand into this thing recently. Look at the tires. It still has the brand new nubs on them. These are, these are I just, actually, I just pulled that one off, sorry. <laughs> uh, these are the brand new, the, the nubs aren't even worn on the tires. The rear tires are brand new also. Um, so it's a Dunlop Elite 3. Look at this rear tire. Check it out, zero miles on the rear tire, zero miles on the front tire, brand new exhaust, brand new carburetors, new battery. Um, I think it has a new battery, don't quote me on that one. But uh, I know it fires right up first kick and uh, this thing falls in the mail. It's a high performance Triumph 750 Bonville top end on a 650 uh, lower end. So kick ass bike, real, this thing makes a statement everywhere you go. It's a conversation piece. Um, it's on display in the New England Motorcycle Museum now. You want to buy an awesome Christmas present for someone who would really appreciate this. This is it. You couldn't build this bike. You'd probably spend seven, eight, ten grand to build this bike, and uh, at least if you could even find the parts. So, uh, give me a call if you have any questions. Eight six zero nine one six nine seven eight four. Thank you very much. God bless. Merry Christmas and good luck bidding.